want to buy something that's going to cover me in emergencies if I can use it during not emergency times, right? Nobody wants to spend $500 on something that they'll only use in worst case scenarios. Well, this is gonna be one of those products for you. And it's called the Goal Zero Yeti Power Station. So first and foremost, yes, it's a 21st century generator. It's the way that when there is a storm, a flood, a fire, a brownout, a blackout, a hurricane, a tornado, when you run out of power, you have a way to plug in your CPAP machine. You have a way to plug in your, your child's nebulizer. You have a way to plug in and charge your phone, your kid's tablets, your, your modems. You, you really do have the backup support that you need. And because this model comes with a solar panel, you really never worry about running out of power. You know, Hurricane Irma, most of us, we were out of power for about a week. When you buy a 21st century generator that can run inside your home, that doesn't require gas, that doesn't have any leaky issues, that doesn't create a lot of noise, that can be run inside, you can stay safe and comfortable inside and have a fan pointed at you, have a personal evaporative cooler pointed at you, and be charging your device and entertain and relax and go, huh, I got this hurricane stuff covered, I'm good. I'm relaxed, I'm comfortable, I'm taken care of. So it's there for you in those worst case scenarios. But this is also a fun device. This is a way to do a projector movie in the backyard of your house with your kids on a sorry summer night. This is a way to have a bubble machine and a popcorn machine plugged in and running on a birthday party at a park. This is a way for you to be able to go camping and have all of your comfort devices right by your side so that you get to glamp rather than camp. This is a device that can go with you tailgating and plug in a radio, a TV, whatever you want to it. It is that protection that you need, that backup power source that you want in an emergency. But it's also going to come off the shelf and come out for a whole heck of a lot of fun in the meantime. Now, Chris Steele is joining us to talk us through Gold Zero, to give you a, a tour of this wonderful, powerful model and show you all the different things you can plug into it. Thank you so much for being here. Good really to appreciate you. you. Yeah, excited to be here. You know, I really do love uh, products that deliver for worst case scenario, and then we can have some fun to boot. Well, and that's a great way to put it, too. Yeah. We talk about it so often. People, uh, many times, you're, you're forced off the grid as a result of a storm, a hurricane, earthquake, whatever it may be. But there's also times you maybe you want to you want to live off the grid or you want to camp off the grid. This is what you're getting right here. You're getting the Goal Zero Yeti 400 watt solar generator. Okay, like Brett said, forget the fumes, forget the fuel. You don't have to worry about that. But you're also getting the solar panel that is one of three ways that you can charge your solar generator. Right. So you're all set. You have everything you need. You're not off the grid. You're just taking the grid with you. So so three ways. I'm assuming plug it into the wall. Assuming you've plug got it power. Wall, plug yes. it into the car. Twelve volt. Gating. 12 volt adapter yep. uh, or the solar panel. If you're without power or completely, you know, a Joshua tree or something, yes. you can also plug, and the solar panel's included. Other brands charge two, three, four hundred dollars for a solar panel to plug in. We include it as part of your purchase when you buy Goal Zero. Yes. So real quick, let me just show you, you got two wall adapters right there. And again, this is just like plugging into your, your wall adapter. That's exactly what you're getting. You got two USB and you'll also have a 12 volt adapter as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and just show you. This is our charge port right here. Let me unplug that to show you. We're fully powered up. I'm gonna go ahead and start my power. Now one of the things that is really cool about this, Brett, is you can isolate your power. So you don't need to be using power if you don't need it. For instance, I'm gonna plug in my 12 volt. I'll go ahead and start my power there with my 12 volt and I've got my light. Mm -hmm. Okay, obviously light is something that's very important. You touched on something that's very important as well, that uh, when somebody, when power goes out in an emergency, CPAP machine is, yeah. is crucial. Well, okay. for me, I always go here because both my mother and my father use CPAP machines. I, as a child, was an asthmatic who used a nebulizer. When we had power outages, my asthma would spike instantly and immediately because I knew I wouldn't have access to my nebulizer. Absolutely, yeah. it's not something you can mess around with. Yeah. Now again, what I love, you can isolate this, the power is on, I'm gonna turn off my 12 volt and turn on my wall adapter there. So that way I know I've got my power and like that, the CPAP machine is powered up. So you guys, I know this is gonna sound a little silly, but it's a nice little vision to imagine. What if you decided that you needed to work, but you also needed kind of like a day off? What if you decided that you wanted to run your business for one day out in the middle of the Grand Canyon, you could do it with a Goal Zero. 
work actually sounds pretty fun if you can do it sitting right in front of the, the grid. I couldn't not, you know, show you that image and just imagine. That's what this power station can do for you. Yes, it'll recharge your tablets, your cell phones. Yes, you can even plug a big screen TV into it. It gives you that much power. If you're looking for a gift for the hiker, the biker, the camper, the fisherman in your life, they will absolutely love what this can do for them. And you will love knowing that they have real deal power available to be safer, to be more comfortable, to be more covered and cared for. We like to say we want to take you out farther and let you stay out longer. Right. And spend time with the people that really matter. And that's what it allows you to do. In fact, our founder really was inspired to start Goal Zero when he was traveling to third world countries and uh, saw how people tried to function without their power. Mm -hmm. And that's where he came up with an idea. And one of the things that a lot of people don't know is back in 2009, when we were uh, just getting ready to launch, we were in negotiations with a large manufacturer, and that's when the earthquake hit Haiti. Mm. Well, we dropped everything and sent everything to Haiti. Wow. And actually, that's when we quickly became known as the company to go to when there are these emergency situations. This is one of those things that, you know, you hear people talk about uh, extreme preppers and they have TV shows for them and all that. And many people look at that and they think, well, that's just, it's too, too much, you know? And this, they think, but I'm not doing anything. Well, if you're gonna do one thing, this is the one thing that you wanna have with well, you. Well, and let's be honest with you. I mean, for most of us have, we're, we've ascribed to the uh, assumption from the last 20, 30 years of, I have a generator. That's my backup. Yeah. Well, do you know how much gas we had access to here in Florida after Hurricane Irma? <laughs> yeah, all of none. Yeah. Do you, I don't know about you, but my generator sits in my garage and I had to lay cat litter underneath it to deal <laughs> with all the leaking. Uh, do you know that a generator cannot be used indoors? Do you know the generator cannot be used in an apartment building, whether you've got a terrace, a balcony or not? Uh, the, the old style of fix is not applicable to most of us today. And quite frankly, after Hurricane Irma was done coming through the area, it was too gosh darn hot to be running a generator outside and not being able to close your home up because you've got cords and cables coming inside. You know, it's not safe. You can't lock your home. It's left outdoors. It's loud. It's a hot mess, no pun intended. <laughs> this is the better solution. This is the more comfortable, safer, more practical solution to keep the kids entertained and relaxed, to keep you safely inside your home and have anything and everything you could possibly imagine plugged in. And you you know, t you know, put it through its paces. You can plug in a power strip and plug mm -hmm. in several things at a time. You can plug in, like Chris is doing right now, a USB port and charge a whole bunch of devices at a time. You can grow and expand the Goal Zero out as much as you could possibly want. And remember, if you're somebody that goes, oh, I've seen these before and they're only gonna help me for a day or two. Well, when you buy Goal Zero, you get a solar panel. Now you can plug it into a wall if you have power, you can plug it into a car if you wanna recharge it that way, but, only when you buy Goal Zero do you get a solar panel included in your purchase that you can plug in. So now you could go days on end being able to recharge it and reuse it. You can go tailgating. I mean, look at these guys. They're barbecuing, they're setting up TVs, they're having a party. Well, it, yeah, it's a good point you brought up before. We're getting ready for hurricane season, but it's not gonna be long, we'll be ready for football season. Yeah. And if you're tailgating, you wanna know that you're prepared. And I just wanna show you real quick with the solar panel because it's important. It's got a great kickstand. It just drops right into place, just like that. Yeah, it's an impressive solar panel. I mean, it's the real deal. And on the back, just to show you also, you also can chain this solar panel to additional solar panels. So you have the ability to do that as well. So it does allow you to chain it. This power adapter plugs in just like the wall adapter does. So it's very simple to use. Just put it in place and you've got your power source right there. Okay, so uh, just a, a bit of business so everybody's aware. This is a brand new product to us here at HSN. Uh, as you see, we're talking 30 plus recharges on devices before it needs to be recharged itself. And even though it's brand new and pretty much a new product to the industry, we're offering you a great sale today. We are throwing in the solar panel and offering you a $75 savings off the regular price that we will offer this product for here at HSN. We are also shipping it door to your door free of charge, and this is a big guy. That's a big box, and we're spending the cost to get it to you. And we're giving you flexible payments. FlexPay is for everybody. 
any major debit or credit card, you spend $83 and we ship it to your door free of charge. We take tax with the first flex pay, but it's all interest and finance free. If you are planning to go camping this summer and you'd like to change it into glamping, if you are worried about hurricane season, if you've got an old generator and don't have any interest in using it ever again, get this home and try it out for less than $84. And if you're not impressed, we have a 30 day return policy. But it's only those of you up late and starting your Friday right off with us here at HSN that are going to get the chance to see this very much of the now needed product as more storms are heading our way. And as summer means, we go outdoors more often. I mean, look, Chris is even going to run a TV <laughs> off I'm the Goal Zero. I'm plugged in here. And uh, for those kids that are up late... This is a radio right here <laughs> because let's face it, if you want to, in an emergency situation, you want to stay connected, find out what's going on, uh, a radio is a great way to do that. I got my TV powered up, I got my radio powered up, and I wanna show you real quick because it is so easy to use. I'll turn that down. Take a look at the LCD screen here. It's showing you exactly how much power is coming in and exactly how much is going out. Very simple to use. You can see your wattage right there. I got my TV powered up. I've got the radio powered up. You can see I'm using about 54 watts of power. That's again, this is not plugged in. This has been fully charged. And we recommend that you just keep it charged. Keep mm -hmm. it charging at all times. Yeah. Use it, as you said, use it throughout the year. Go, if you're going out fishing, you're going out hunting, you're going camping, you're in the workshop, whatever it may be, Take advantage of it because hey, listen, let's face for, it. For whatever it's worth, this is the only way anybody's ever going to get me to go camping. Because <laughs> with this guy, I can blow up an air mattress. I can have a fan running. I can have a bug zapper running. You'll almost get me out into the wilderness with a goal zero. Well, and let's face it. It looks pretty darn cool, doesn't yeah. it? Yeah. I mean, it is a great looking unit. So remember, you can recharge it three ways. You can obviously plug it into a wall for additional power. You can obviously plug it into your car to recharge it maybe when you get to the campsite, but you are also including a solar panel. I mean, I think sometimes we look at these devices and we think, yeah, sure, it'll help me for a couple of days, but after Hurricane Irma, it was a week. Yeah, sure, it'll help me, but I'm not gonna bring it with me on my seven day fishing trip when it's only gonna help me on days one and two. You get this great big solar panel included in your purchase today for under $500. It's not an additional two, $300 purchase, and it's a real deal solar panel that allows you to plug in and recharge throughout the day uh, without ever having to worry about plugging back in again. Now, we, we offer this today as we are focused on emergency preparedness, the CPAP machines, the mini fridges for your medications that need to be kept cool, your nebulizers, your lights, your fans, your uh, ability to recharge your devices, but there's a lot of great fun to be had with this too. I mean, sometimes we gotta keep working, right? Just because you are in the middle of a storm doesn't mean your clients are. You know, we talked about that before, Brett. It's so true, people are working, many people are working from their house, uh, and something's happening here, they don't know about it in Chicago, they don't know about it in New York, so you have to stay plugged in. So I'm gonna literally right here, we've got our office set up. One thing that people don't realize is your router at home, it runs off your cable. Mm -hmm. So as long as you can provide power to it, you are ready to go. So I'm gonna go ahead and use a power strip in this case to show you that I can go ahead and power up all of my tools that, I am, that I'm needing for the office. My power strip going there. Mm -hmm. I'll get my laptop plugged into the power strip also. And you'll see that all of this can run off of one power strip. I got my printer. What else do I need, Brett? I got my phone. I don't know, maybe like a, a blender and make some margaritas. I mean, if you're, I could do you that gotta, too. I keep working through this storm. I Might could as do that be too. Enjoyable. I'll plug in another phone I too. guess plug in the phone, plug yeah. in the tablet. I mean, seriously, a printer even? I mean, he's just showing off. We've got now. the printer, but the router is something that really is important. People don't realize, well, I was talking to Russell here in the studio earlier today, and he was saying that the last time there was a storm, uh, his wife works from home. She had a huge, you hear the printer going there, mm -hmm. had a huge uh, client she was working for, a huge project, and if she was not powered up, she couldn't. She would have lost, lost the, 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 job. the whole job. Yeah. Yes, absolutely. Yeah, I mean, at the end of the day, the, the hurricane, the earthquake, it doesn't happen everywhere. And again, let's even think about this as a nicer way. If you're feeling a little cooped up, if you're, you're feeling a little trapped in life, maybe you just feel like taking your office to the great outdoors. Maybe you've decided that today, uh, your home-based business isn't based in Scranton, Pennsylvania, but rather 
at the top of the Grand Canyon. <laughs> all of a sudden, work sounds kind of nice, doesn't it? All of a sudden, the idea of that major report and proposal being due seems really quite manageable when you're sitting at the top of, uh, of the Grand Canyon to get it done. Well, the Goal Zero Yeti can help make that happen. And really, it, we buy it for the worst case scenario, but nothing makes me happier than knowing that something I buy for the worst case scenario is there for some pretty awesome scenarios Absolutely. as well. Absolutely, yeah, yeah. And, and create opportunities for you. Take a look at that LCD screen. You can see I've got my entire office here ready, plugged in, ready to go, powered up, and I'm using 27, 28 watts uh, of power right there. So I'm gonna be powered for hours. Mm -hmm. And uh, again, you're not, you wouldn't keep all this powered up at one time, but it allows me to stay connected. It allows me to stay safe. Mm -hmm. It allows me to, uh, to, to function for however long I'm gonna be without power just with the one unit. And again, because it comes with a solar panel, it's sustainable, portable power that you I mean, have it's endless. You. Yeah, absolutely. It You're really covered. is endless. There, there, you don't really have to ever say, I guess it's time to go home because it's <laughs> not right. working. I That's mean, right. if you're looking for an escape, man, you you're, know, you gotta, you gotta make sure you're supplied up and ready to go. Uh, it's, a, it's a wonderful product. It's a great brand that stopped everything they were doing to build their business to go help people in Haiti. It's something I think you can feel really good about. You can feel really good knowing that you are no longer susceptible. A brownout, a blackout, just in the neighborhood, a power line is down, and suddenly you're able to continue watching whatever live broadcast you were in the middle of watching. Suddenly, the kids don't say, well, I can't finish my homework now uh, because our neighborhood power went out. So that if, gosh forbid, Irma should come our way again this year, we have something that does not involve gas, that does not involve leaks, that does not involve fumes, and does not involve traipsing a big bulky mess of a thing outside our homes when everybody is scared, when the weather is terrible, and when we just need to know we've got our creature comforts, we've got our backup health devices, we've got what we need to survive and to thrive. It's all here for you today and for the launch of Goal Zero at HSN, you are not only getting your one-of-a-kind, super powerful, portable station, you're also getting a 